Hey guys, it's the Cider Fanatic here. Today I have another beer review for you guys to enjoy. And I have a local craft beer, as you can see here. So yeah guys, this is the uh, this is from Brygghuset Finn, uh, or the Finn Brewing House in English, which is situated in Lund in southern Sweden. They are a uh, very respectable craft, micro craft brewery. And this is actually the first one I'm about to try from that brewery. And as you can see, we have a wheat beer. And this is their raspy wheat from their series Derailed. And it is made here, as you can see, with raspberries. Pretty nice, inviting label there. Uh, so as you can see, it's a 330 milliliter bottle here. And this one clocks in at seven points. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry, five point seven percent ABV. So yeah, guys, it's a it's a five point seven percent ABV. It's a wheat beer, and it is made with champagne yeast, uh, according to the uh, website of the company. And uh, the hops used are Magnum and Mosaic, and the malts are Pilsner malt and wheat malt. So yeah guys, uh, without much further ado, let's crack this one open and see what we get. So here you got the, uh, there you go, you got the uh, cat there, pretty, co pretty cool one I would say, because I'm gonna put the camera down like that. Let's crack this one open guys. There we go, a little bit of smoke on the opening there. Let's get this one out into the glass. Oh, really nice color there. Really nice color. So I'm going to give it a aggressive pour. There we go. I have a little bit more left in the bottle, but I'm gonna shake it because I think there are some sediments in here, of course, which would make this one a little bit of a hazy beer. So yeah, let's see. Let's take a quick look here guys, as you can see pretty nice there, we have a kind of a three, three and a half finger head there. We have some really light red, ruby red, almost ruby red color there, a little bit of a reddish white foam as well. Let's take a quick whiff here and see what we get. Oh. Yeah, guys, so I mean, oh, here's the cap. There you go, kind of busted up, but that's how it is. So yeah, guys, it's a really, really nice smell. It's definitely kind of a vinous smell, tart smell there. You can definitely notice the raspberries in there. So that's a kind of a good sign, I would say. Really, really inviting smell, vinous, but you do have a little bit of hoppiness there as well. So both like wine and beer in the same uh, aroma there. Pretty cool. I'm going to take a sip of this one, guys. Cheers, and here's to Brighuset Finn and their raspy wheat. Mm. Oh yeah, pretty pretty refreshing, guys. It's a pretty refreshing beer. So up front, you definitely get some kind of champagne, what vinous quality is there. Definitely a real solid uh, flavor of uh, raspberries, guys. So that's a really good sign. They have used a lot of raspberries in here. Really, really nice. I'm going to pour up the rest here and see what we get. So here we go, guys. There we go. Beer is out into the glass completely. Really, really nice. Look at the color, guys. Look at the color. Let's take another one. Mm. Mm. So, yeah, guys, it's a really interesting beer. A mm. little bit of bitterness in the uh, aftertaste there, but definitely some tartness from the raspberries. 
good deal of raspberries in there. Mm. Really lovely, really nice, guys. Uh, kind of a mix of both kind of vinous qualities and hoppy beer qualities as well. Let's take a final sip and rate it. Mm. So, yeah, guys. Oh, a few drops left there. A little bit of sediment as well. So, yeah, guys, this is the uh, Raspy Wheat from Brygghuset Finn uh, out of their Derail series. Really nice beer, refreshing, kind of a good combination there of vinous qualities, beer qualities as well. Lovely wheat beer, lovely smell and flavor of raspberries, solid balanced beer of tartness and bitterness as well. It's a nice one, guys. It's a 3 out of 5. So I will rate this as a 3 out of 5 from the Cider Fanatic. 3.5, 3 I'm sorry, 3.5 out of 5. Really lovely beer, guys. Uh, take care. Enjoy yourself, you know. Uh, thumb me up if you like the review. Have a good one.